Hey everyone, it's Johnny here. So today is World Mental Health Day. So I thought I'd create something that I can put out there to you guys to reach out, talk a little bit about me and talk about some of the things that we do here at Sea to help the people around us and look out for each other. So I myself have suffered from mental health in the past. Running your own business can be difficult. And there's been times financially that it's been hard. There's been times that have been really stressful with family and managing my time, and being exhausted and stressed out, and I have suffered. I tend to find that the times that I've suffered the most is when I've been unbalanced. So that might be that I've been unbalanced financially or physically or spiritually or emotionally. And when I'm in those periods, that's when I found that my mental health has suffered, whether it be through anxiety and through difficult times, I've had a bit of depression. Um, and one thing that we incorporated at Seed, it's a few years ago now, was a thing called checking in. And this has really, really helped me and it's helped um, my team around me, is that when we have a meeting, whether it be weekly or, or every few weeks, um, we check in right at the beginning. It gives the opportunity for people to talk about how they're feeling, um, what's going on in their world within work and outside of work. And that process of just being able to talk through your feelings and what's going on is, is cathartic, it's therapeutic. It can be really, really useful in terms of just letting things out and letting people know around you about how you're feeling. Um, and we try to do this as much as we can. Now, not every, it doesn't work for everyone. You know, we, some people are quite private, so they don't wanna talk about their feelings too much. For me, I'm quite open and transparent and it's really, really helped me. Um, but if you, if you do work with people or know people in your, in your inner circle, your family and friends, and they are private, just being with someone, just being able to kind of say how, how are things going or let them take their mind off what's going on, just being close to someone and let them know that you're there for them can be really, really helpful. Uh, I heard a few months ago a great saying that health doesn't always have to be healthy. So just being with friends, if you want to let your hair down, have a drink or go out and do whatever you've got to do, that can be really important in these times where people are stressed out and they are suffering. So it's, it's just about being there for people, asking meaningful questions and listening as much as you can. Now to take it that step further is to get outside, get out in the open, get out in nature, go for a walk. If you, if you know someone that you think is struggling and, and you know, they're not themselves, they're quiet, they, they, they don't seem themselves, then just try and get out, just go meet up, whether it be a cup, a cup of tea or go for a walk through a park or wherever it is, just try and get together, check in, make sure they're all right. Um, and that alone, just that small gesture can, can mean so much. So on this day, you know, check in with the people around you, let them check in with you. Um, that can be your work colleagues, it can be your friends, it can be your family. If you know one out, anyone out there that you think aren't quite themselves and might be struggling, reach out to them. Um, force them to go out and, and go for a walk with you or force them to go out for a drink. You know, you know what people are like. It can be quite private and they don't want to talk about things. And when you are feeling a bit low and down, sometimes you, you, know, you don't want to meet people. So try and push them a little bit to to meet up and and if you are feeling you know you're not yourself and you you're in a really dark place then seek help you know speak to your doctor speak to people around you and let them know how you're feeling and um, try and get some help wherever you can anyway i hope that's been useful for you so check in make sure that people around you are checking in and make sure that you, you know, you've got people's back and you're keeping an eye on them but remember, be useful, be kind, and I'll see you all soon. Bye-bye.